ग्लोमेरोला फिल्ट्रेशन रेट ग्लोमेरोला फिल्ट्रेशन रेट और जी एफ आर इज डिफाइन एज द अमाउंट ऑफ ब्लड फिल्टर्ड बाय द ग्लोमेरोलिस दैट पास थ्रू इट इन अ गिवन पॉइंट ऑफ टाइम The kidneys play a vital role in regulating the body's internal environment that includes functions like formation of RBCs, mineral metabolism and excretion of waste products. Improper functioning of kidneys can lead to electrolyte imbalance and fluid accumulation. These two together can be fatal for life and can lead to death eventually. Glomerular filtration rate is a test to check how well the kidneys are working. If the GFR is low, that means the kidneys are not working well. An early detection of low GFR can allow for early treatment. So GFR is important for determining the stage of chronic kidney disease, which guides in major decisions like drug dosing or living organ donation. GFR is measured in ml per minute for a body surface area. of 1.73 meter square the gfr levels in a healthy young adult is 100 to 130 ml per minute per 1.73 meter square it is found to decrease with age by 10 ml per minute every 10 years gfr can be as low as 15 ml per minute or less and can lead to hematuria albuminuria and severe uremia severe uremia may require dialysis or kidney transfer for survival So what determines the GFR? The glomerular capillary pressure which is exerted by the blood in the glomerular capillaries and is about 60 mm Hg. The colloidal osmotic pressure exerted by the plasma proteins in the glomeruli and it is about 25 mm of Hg. And the hydrostatic pressure in the Bowman's capsule which is 15 mm Hg. So the net filtration pressure that pushes the liquid out is 20 mm Hg. The conditions that affect the glomerular filtration rate are atherosclerosis, diabetes, and chronic nephritis. So, how do we measure GFR? GFR cannot be measured directly in kidney because urine is constantly filtered and it changes its composition throughout the kidney. GFR is measured by calculating the rate of elimination of clearance of a marker, mainly exogenous or endogenous. those are injected into the blood stream inulin is one such polysaccharide which is used to measure gfr inulin is effective in determining the gfr as it does not get secreted or absorbed by the kidney but it can be filtered through the glomeruli renal clearance of inulin is considered to be the gold standard however there are certain shortcomings it is a complicated process and it is expensive Other markers that are used for measuring glomerular filtration rate are the DTPA or diethylene triamine pentaacetic acid, radioactively tagged EDTA, which gives accurate results, and the renal clearance of creatinine. The problem with exogenous markers is their administration and performing the clearance measurements. Hence, endogenous markers like creatinine are preferred. Creatinine is a biomarker and present in human serum. and urine it is a by product of muscle catabolism and obtained through meat creatinine clearance is used in estimation of glomerular filtration rate it is the volume of plasma cleared of creatinine per unit time creatinine is freely filtered by the glomerulus secreted by the kidney in very small amount but can overestimate the gfr by about 10 to 20% the advantages are it is easier to perform the procedure and has a low cost the normal creatinine clearance rate is 100 to 150 ml per minute for males and 100 to 130 ml per minute for females creatinine clearance is assessed from the amount of creatinine that is exerted in a 24 hour urine collection and a single measurement of serum creatinine creatinine levels for men are 0.6 to 1.2 mg per deciliter and for women is 0.5 to 1.1 mg per deciliter 
Elevated creatinine levels and a decreased creatinine clearance rate are usually indications of low GFR and abnormal renal function. The clinical significance of glomerular filtration rate is it helps in staging of chronic kidney disease and nephropathy quantification. It is also helpful in drug dose adjustments. So to summarize, glomerular filtration rate is the amount of blood filtered by the glomerulus that passes through it in a given point of time. It is a test to determine how well the kidneys are functioning. Normal glomerular filtration rate are 10 to 130 ml per minute per 1.73 meter square. Estimation of GFR is performed by calculating the creatinine levels and the creatinine clearance. Elevated levels of creatinine and decrease of creatinine clearance indicates that abnormal cranial function is present. You can find the link to MCQs for the topic in the description of the video. Thank you for watching the video. We hope you liked it. And if you did, please subscribe to the channel for more videos and hit the notification bell for update on new videos. So see you in the next video. Till then, stay healthy and have an amazing week.